Hi everyone, in this video I'm gonna show you how to create a Gantt chart in Trello. So first step is creating an account in teamgantt.com. Once you created an account in teamgantt.com, you're gonna see something like this. After that, you go back to Trello, click in show menu, then you click in power ups, then you type TM Gant, this one. Click in add, then click in this button here for settings. Click in edit power up settings, then click in this green button. Link your Team Gant account. Now you're gonna click in this green button, authorize now, and then you click in this option, sign in here. Put your address, your password, and click in this green button. Then you click in allow and then you select a project. Main project is Trello plus Gantt chart. This one, the only one I've got. Click in continue and that's it. You can close the power up and the menu tab. Now we can create our tasks. So if we create one card here in Trello, then we will be able to see that card in Tim Gunt. Let's create the first task. Task one. Two, task three. Synchronizing, we can click in view in Team Gantt button, view in Gantt chart. Now we can see our three tasks. Let's rename this group, analysis. Let's create another group, dev, and another group for QA. And we can add tasks here. Let's put task four, task five, task six, task 7. Now we can see all the tasks in here. If we click in the details of the tasks, now we will be able to see the percentage of done, the start date, the end date, and the dependencies. If we go back to Tim Gunt, now we can click on the dates to set the dates for the tasks. And do this for task 4, task 5, task 6, and task 7. So if we click on this button and drag to the next task, then we have a dependency on those tasks. Let's do the same for this, the same for this, 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 and the last one. So if we change the duration of one task, this is very important. If we click in yes, Gantt chart is going to change the dates automatically for us. If we click no, it's going to be manual. So I want it automatic. So I'm going to click in yes. So as you can see, if we change the duration of one task, the other tasks, they will be changed as well. Like this. Going back to Trello. Let's click on the first task and change the percentage. Let's put 20. Now we can see it's dependent on the task two. We can move this task to in progress. We can move the second one as well, the third one. We can mark as 100%. If we go to Team Gantt again, we can see the percentage of done. Let's change this to 70% and if we go to Trello and refresh we will be able to see this card with 70% of done. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Cheers, bye!